Now in order to actually type in specific measurements for shapes in Tinkercad or to see what's called the dimensions, you need to enable the ruler function. To do this, I can very simply click and drag on the ruler from my toolbar and drop it anywhere onto the work plane. Now when I click on a shape, all of its dimensions will actually appear. So I can click on this uh, uh, the dimension here and say for example I want this to be 3 and then hit the enter key and it went ahead and turned my rectangle into a 3 inch tall rectangle. Same thing for the cylinder. I can actually go ahead and change the dimension so I can make it a 2 inch ellipse or if I make both sides 2 inches it turns back into being a circle. I could even use the ruler to tell the overall dimensions between objects. So if I want the overall width of this rectangle and the circle to say be 3.5 Five inches, it will actually manipulate and move these objects closer together for me to make that dimension true. If I want to disable the dimensions because it kind of does fill up the screen here, I can actually click on the X of the ruler tool and the ruler will go away. So now the shapes are kind of a more um, less cluttered view and you can always drag and drop the ruler back onto the work plane to enable the dimension functions again.